Welcome Japanese woodblock print collectors and enthusiasts. This is part two of my most expensive woodblock prints series. In part one, we looked at woodblock prints from the Christie's auction website. The artwork ranged from $2.7 million to $106,000. In this part two video, we'll look at 10 other popular Japanese artists and their prints that sold for large sums. I'm not going to repeat any of the artists from the first video. Let's begin. First on the list, we have Totoya Hokei with Nagato Mekari Shinji, or the Seaweed Gathering Ritual at Nagato from the series Shokoku Meisho, or Famous Places in the Provinces. Hokei was one of Hokusai's first and best known students. I was not familiar with this print, but I really like it. It's a very imaginative and energetic composition with these two men, one with a torch, running out amongst the waves to gather seaweed. It sold for an even $100,000 in 2021. Next, we have a print from Hosoda Eisho. Little is known about his life except that his teacher was Hosoda Eishi. This print is the courtesan Shinsuka of the Shin Zutamaya House from the series Kakuchu Bijin Kurabe or Contest of Tea House Beauties. This print also comes in at $100,000. Fun fact, up until 1765, the Japanese were only printing in two or three colors. Then along came this next artist, Suzuki Harunobu, a prolific artist and innovator. He created the Nishiki-e technique, or brocade picture, which uses multiple separate wood blocks in the creation of a single image. Now ukiyo-e prints could use up to 10 different colors on a single sheet of paper. This is one of his prints, Women at the Seashore, with poem, from the series 36 Immortal Poets published around 1766. This print sold for $84,100 in 2011. The poem reads, Driven by the wind, waves break into spray on a rock. Alone I suffer as my heart and contentment smash into pieces. Our next artist was a student of Hokei's and Hokusai's, Yashima Gakute. This is his print, Giant Black Carp in Water Weeds. It's embellished with metallic pigment and embossing from the series Kaminoge Suigo Ren, or Waterfish Poems for the Kaminoge group. It sold for $81,900. I love the immensity of this carp and the pine needle pattern in the background. This next artist is very popular these days. I see a lot of his prints for sale at increasingly high prices. Kawase Hasui. This is his Konjiki Hall at Hirai Zumi, published by Watanabe in 1957. Hasui was a prominent designer of the Shin Hanga or New Prints movement. And Hasui considered himself a realist and employed his understanding of Western painting in his compositions. This cold, snowy image was the last print he designed before his death in 1957. It sold for $75,000 in 2021. Next, we have Utagawa Kunimasa. The print is of the actor Ichikawa Omezo I as Tashiro Yasube from an untitled series of okubi, or large head, portraits of actors. At least 21 prints are known of this series, and many of the prints have eyes which have been touched in with white pigment. I think it has a bit of a Sharaku influence. There were very few impressions of this portrait known, and it sold for $73,000 in 2008. This next contemporary looking print is by Tori Kotondo. It's called Kamisuki, or Combing the Hair, and sold for $72,500 in 2019. 
This beautiful print was published in 1933, and a previous edition, published in 1930, originally featured the woman fully nude. The print was banned after authorities declared it to be provocative, destroying 30 of its 100 copies. And for those of you that are curious as to what it looked like, I was, here it is. Our next artist is Ito Shinsui. This is Yujo, a courtesan. Shinsui is one of the great names of the Shin Hanga art movement, and he was forced to drop out of elementary school in the third grade and become a live-in apprentice at a printing shop. This print sold for $60,000 in 2021. I really like her natural pose, facing us with her head tilted forward. I think she looks tired or deep in thought. What do you think? Next is one of my favorite artists, Tsukioka Yoshitoshi. This is Fujiwara Yasumasa Plays the Flute by Moonlight. It sold for $47,880 in 2023. This image is based on an ancient tale in which Fujiwara was playing his flute on Ichihara Moor, and the bandit Kidomaru, who intends to kill him, is hiding in the reeds. However, the bandit is overcome by the beauty of the music and abandons his plan. This print is a beautiful use of the triptych format and demonstrates why Yoshitoshi is one of the last great ukiyo-e artists. Our tenth and last artist is Ichirakute Eisui. This is Yoyo Haru of the House of Matsubaya. It sold for $47,880 in 2023. Eisui was also a student of Totoya Hoke. Remember the first artist from five minutes ago? His specialty was a bust portraits, and I think you can see the strong influence of the artist Utamaro. And that wraps up part two. One of my viewers reminded me that the prints I've chosen from Christie's are just a small subset of all the prints that are sold. There are many private sales and sales through other channels that are quite substantial. I hope this video has introduced you to some artists you weren't familiar with. Woodblock prints are not only beautiful to look at and fun to collect, they can also be a very good investment. And on that note, please like and subscribe and happy collecting.